The leader hunter I've examined is only resistant to your assimilation abilities. You need to weaken it first. It has two brains and two spinal columns. Break both backs, and it enters a recovery state. During this time, it's vulnerable to consumption. Strange. This almost seems like an adaptation to your methods. Use the leader we've captured. Subdue and consume it. Then find and consume the one who took Dana. It should reveal her location. Alright. We're back with the prototype hard difficulty walkthrough by Ares. Um, what we're going to do is start out here is have your whip fist out. Um, and we're just going to enter here. Hopefully there's not a loading screen. No, there's not. Alright, now, this hunter is in an extremely weak state, and all it'll take is one hit from your Y attack, which, there it goes, it's already in there, and then just latch onto it with B, and then consume it, and I'll see you after the cutscene. Alright, now we can use the infected vision, which is the most useless power in the game. In fact, all the visions are completely useless. Um, all you need it is for... it's not useless for this part. Um, it's quite necessary, but afterwards it's pretty damn useless. So what I was doing here is I was just getting the guy who's infected. Infected military guys will glow. The rest you can just do whatever you want with. Um, hmm. First time I played through this, I didn't really understand what it meant by consume the infected military at this one base which you'll see in a second like um, you can go ahead and just toy around with these guys eat them boom love that and I went ahead and disguised myself these things seem so instinctive but organized hive mind if I can tap into their stream of thought, then it's possible I could find Dana. Maybe Elizabeth Green. So here, he's going on blabbing about something I don't really care about. Something about Elizabeth Green, something about Hive Mind. Play it for yourself if you want to know the story. This is my second time playing through, and I already understand everything, so. I think. There's just one part I wasn't completely sure of. Um. Alright, so what you want to do is when you come over to this military base that has the arrow on it, um, any military glowing people that you see, try to stealth consume. If you cannot stealth consume, then, um, this was really awkward. I just grabbed this guy and consumed him instantly, and the military didn't see me somehow. Um, this next guy, they caught me on. What you want to do is just grab and consume people as fast as possible. Um... Anybody that seems like they're giving off a glow, just go ahead and consume them. I was getting laid down a lot of fire here, so I just had to run around like crazy. Now, the best way I found to grab people was to use my whip fist. Um, you might find this better as well. You can go onto, like, really high rooftops. Um, that would probably be a better way, but for me, there is no better way than balls out. So. so here I was getting a strike team and just get my ass handed to me, so um I was trying to I couldn't get a lock on to the infected guy. I really wish that it would have made that as your first lock on, but it doesn't, so thank God for adrenaline surge. So for the last few luckily that landmark orb was there and I not sure. No, it didn't give me health. Um, so for the last two guys, I just went, just grabbed and consumed. And because of the gain in health that I got from consuming these guys, I didn't die. Um, 
So that's that part of the object objective. Now we're just running away. Um, I kind of got distracted because there was a guy from uh, Web of Intrigue, so I consumed him. But uh, that's all that's left for this part. Next part, we're going to be consuming the hunter leader that took Dana. Division or another. Blacker than black, these fucks. They got no rank, no fucking protocol, they're fucking barbarians. And they're in charge. Feel it. 